Christopher Gardner is an American entrepreneur and investor whose name sounds like success and hard work. Gardner was born into a world full of problems, and his story is an example to many people who want a better future. Gardner is best known for his book, The Pursuit of Happiness, which was later made into a highly praised movie. Gardner's net worth has become a topic of interest for many. Christopher Gardner's net worth shows the results of his hard work and smart business sense. In this video, we'll talk about Christopher Gardner net worth, his amazing achievements, and the money he's made along his journey. What is Christopher Gardner's net worth and salary in 2023? In 2023, Christopher Gardner's net worth is estimated to be over $70 million. He got rich through his stock brokerage company, Gardner Rich & Company, the sales of his best-selling books, and his work as a motivational speaker. During his training program to become a stockbroker at Dean Witter, a stock brokerage firm, Gardner was paid $1,000 a month. However, his current salary as Gardner Rich & Company CEO is not publicly disclosed. Christopher Gardner Overview Why is Christopher Gardner famous? Early life Christopher Paul Gardner was born on February 9, 1954, in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. His early life was hard because he was poor and had to deal with problems. Gardner was raised by his single mother, Betty Jean, and an abusive, alcoholic husband. He had a rough childhood, and his mother even tried to kill her partner while he was in foster care. Despite not knowing his biological father and surviving childhood adversity, Gardner became a successful businessman and motivational speaker. Military service and early career Christopher Gardner enlisted in the U.S. Navy after finishing secondary school, inspired by his Uncle Henry's worldwide adventures. Gardner was a hospital corpsman stationed at Camp Lejeune in North Carolina for four years. During his service, he met Dr. Robert Ellis, a well-known cardiac surgeon in San Francisco. Dr. Ellis gave him a job helping with innovative clinical research at the University of California Medical Center and Veterans Administration Hospital in San Francisco. Gardner accepted the offer and moved to San Francisco upon his discharge from the Navy in 1974. Over the next two years, he learned a lot from running a lab and using different surgical methods. By 1976, Gardner had been given full control over a lab and had written several papers with Dr. Ellis that were published in medical journals. But when Gardner realized that the medical field would have changed a lot by the time he could become a doctor, he gave up on his dreams of becoming a doctor. Marriage and career change. Gardner's journey to success began when he married to Sherry Dyson in 1977. As Gardner worked hard to support his family, he and his wife had to deal with many problems, such as money problems and being homeless. Despite the hardships, Sherry remained a steadfast support system for Chris and their son, Christopher Jarrett Medina Gardner, born in 1981. After meeting a man in a red Ferrari, Gardner changed careers from medicine to stockbroking. He later founded Gardner Rich LLC after fighting for a Dean Witter internship. Tragically, in 2012, Gardner's wife passed away from cancer at 55, prompting him to re-evaluate his life and career. After being successful in finance for 30 years, Gardner decided to make a complete career change. He now focuses on motivational speaking and charity through the Chris Gardner Foundation, which aims to give underprivileged youth opportunities. Brokerage Firm In 1987, Christopher Gardner founded Gardner Rich & Company, a brokerage firm. The Chicago-based firm executes debt, equity, and derivative product transactions for major institutions, public pension systems, and unions. Gardner founded the company in his little presidential towers apartment with $10,000 and a wooden desk that functioned as the family dining table. The name Rich was chosen in honor of commodities trader Mark Rich, whom Gardner admired but had never met. Gardner's path to success started when he met a stockbroker named Bob Bridges. Bridges taught Gardner about finance and helped him get into Dean Witter Reynolds' stockbroker training program. Gardner worked hard and kept trying until he was the best trainee at the company. He then went on to Bear Stearns & Company in San Francisco. In 2006, Gardner sold his minority stake in Gardner Rich in a multi-million dollar deal. He became the CEO and founder of Christopher Gardner International Holdings, with offices in New York, Chicago, and San Francisco. Philanthropy. Christopher Gardner's charitable work shows how kind and caring he is. This is because he has struggled with homelessness and faced other problems in his life. 
As a successful businessman, Gardner has given a lot of time, effort, and money to many good causes and groups, such as the CARA Program, Glide Memorial United Methodist Church, National Fatherhood Initiative, National Education Association Foundation, the International Rescue Committee. He provides money and volunteers his time to provide career guidance and job placement assistance to the needy. Gardner promotes financial literacy, fights women's violence and homelessness, and helps children. He learned at a New York brokerage business, working his way up in the company, and making smart financial investments. Eventually, Gardner opened his own stock brokerage and has been CEO ever since. He got rich because he was hungry and wanted to succeed. Chris Gardner net worth is a testament to his unwavering determination and hard work. Despite coming from a disadvantaged background, he transformed his life by relentlessly pursuing his dreams of becoming an entrepreneur. Gardner's story gives us hope and reminds us that success is possible no matter our situation. Finally, thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe us to learn more interesting information about celebrities.